Good morning. All right, y'all. Y'all about to see what I'm willing to do for a hundred dollars. Freaking hundred dollars right here. It's like, I still have to go shop for 46 items at Wegmans, but this is all mine. Well, starting off the day taking some trash. But well, this is the first thing I've seen from DoorDash in an hour and a half. All right, did this Instacart. It's been a slow morning. Look at this fucking bullshit. These people live in these locked buildings. I gotta wait till someone comes out. They don't answer the phone. They don't answer text messages. I gotta wait till someone comes out to sneak in. Then I gotta put my crock in the door so I can hold the door open while I load up. Oh my God. Yeah, I would order groceries too if I lived here, but I would give instructions on what to do instead of just this. And I would answer my phone when people message me. All right, the dude was nice at least. But uh, I just got this Uber. It looks like total crap. But just gotta swing by the McDonald's and then it drops off right next to my house. So perfect order. Got that McDonald's in the car. another McDonald's that last one ended up paying me two extra bucks which is crazy I people very rarely add tip after and because it wasn't a ten dollar order I actually legitimately think she added the tip after but yeah this one lots of miles but ain't nothing happening I can't get on DoorDash the one Instacart I tried to get they they said no uh, someone else got it and any other instacarts no good i gotta get some cash flowing Crackhead jumps on a crack rock. Yeah, this order. I was thinking about biking it, but if you watched yesterday's video, you already know I, I biked for f almost four hours, 62 miles yesterday. So we, I'm, I'm taking it easy today. I am going to go for a bike ride, but it's going to be chill. And I just learned that my phone is almost out of storage. So I gotta edit videos so I can delete. I got a lot, I got a lot of deleting I need to do. All right, I got this stack. All right, I picked up the Mama Romas. It's just a tiramisu. Seven bucks for just a dessert. So this Subway is a $4, but I ain't getting no orders today. And these are dropping off right next to each other. The pickups are right next to each other. Also, all right next to my house. Miles, the money makes sense. Yo, look at this order. This is the weirdest order. It's two Outbacks for seven, seven something. I almost declined it. But then I realized it's going to the same house and then when i look at it both the, there's like two meals each 40 bucks like it's probably a good order all right so that door that has got me all discombobulated all right i just got myself some chick fil a and then this order came in going right back to my house All right, y'all. Y'all about to see what I'm willing to do for a hundred dollars. 
freaking hundred dollars right here it's like i still have to go shop for 46 items at wegmans but this is all mine buy a hatchback Man, my car is sitting low all this water god now i gotta go to wegmans and shop for 46 items oh a hundred dollars is it worth it pretty funny i just said is it worth it like this order would have to take me four hours for me to be upset like really upset and there ain't no way in hell like i <laughs> we got water sliding everywhere back here but uh i had to get them food line guys hustling in the back to find me this much water they had to get a u-boat everyone wanted to know why i was so thirsty what can i say so the logistics on this his ass backwards because i'm supposed to go drop off all these waters then go drop off the wegmans which means i'm gonna have to like take the wegmans out of the car to get the waters out and then put the wegmans back in unless i can fit 46 items in my front seat which i don't have a lot of faith with that one so i don't know what's about to happen all right we got part two of this adventure if you do Instacart, you know, it was a hundred dollar order, so I had all of one second to look at it. Alright, I'm 25 minutes in. I got 18 items left. Oh, Wegmans is so hard. But I'm making I'm getting there. Alright, I completed it. Every minute 40 minutes to get 46 items. I only got 45. Oh man, it is freaking wild in here. So it's crazy. I almost dropped this Instacart because of the water, you know, water situation. But it's so rad because she, the customer texted me and said that they would have kids to help unload the water. And they even said, oh, there's a bus, so I thought I was going to stop. Anyway, they even said, she even said, like, don't come. The school lets out at 3.18. Don't come until after 3.30 because the traffic's going to be crazy. And luckily, I was shopping at Wegmans at that point anyway. So I messaged her back and let her know I was shopping at Wegmans. And that would be after that. So this this order... Because, you know, if you pick up... If you have to go to two grocery stores, you, you don't know. One customer... They, they don't... Know, I don't know if they know or not. I don't know what they know. They just know they're waiting forever. All right, I got all them waters dropped off. Best case scenario, there was a line of kids just running them back and forth. They were all amazed when they saw how many waters it was. It's pretty funny, but that took like five minutes. Totally worth it. And I only had to lift them all up one time. Like they did the rest of the work, so. All right, just got the Wegmans dropped off. A real nice gentleman working on his lawnmower in his driveway. Uh, yeah, that, those 15 waters. A dollar tip for each case of water. It was only a 14 something dollar tip. It's pretty rough. And then the, the Wegmans, you know, heavy hitter, huge tip. But that it was like more than a $200 bill at Wegmans, so it doesn't surprise me. I don't know if I'm working anymore today. Uh, I haven't ridden my bike. It's beautiful out. I was not anticipating making that good of an order, so we'll see. I'll probably get another one, but if not, catch y'all tomorrow.